Um, I was uh, delighted again to find that I was going to be a companion. Well, I've only been one once before, and that was 42, three years ago, when I was companion to Peter Cushing in the, the movie, Daleks in Bid Earth 2150 or whatever it was. Uh, that was the only time I'd been in the TARDIS. Do you like it? I, I thought it'd be cleaner. Cleaner? And the character himself is a bit of a, an astronomer and wanted to go into space or was delighted when Catherine's character went up into space. So to find that I can do it now, as Wilfred is, yes. Wilfred is, is a lot like me, actually. I've even managed to squeeze in my parachute regiment badge. I was talking to Russell some long time ago and he incorporated a little bit about me being in Palestine in '48. Uh, the old soldier's got one more battle. No, it's very good. I'm going to get one for Christmas. <laughs> I felt like a little boy, actually. A little boy. Yeah. No, it's going to be fun, that one. Get going. Um, but I have got a little bag with me in case I'm Uncle Dick. Sick. Uh -huh. Travel sickness. Well, it could be. The way that's travelling. We're doing 700 miles an hour going that way. I'm going round and round as well. Uh, motion sickness and change of underwear. <laughs> That's my department, oh no. <laughs> I, better, I, better, I better go and get prepared. Yes, a few spare knickers. <laughs> spare knickers for the bear now. See you later. Oh, bye. Bye. It's just a group of circumstances, that's all. You no, know, someone said, you know, you're responsible for his demise and whatever, but it's not actually true. It is destiny. I'm just part of it, basically. That's all. It's not a thing I would have wished as a character. Don't I don't think this is goodbye, Will. I'll see you again. But perhaps the new man might engage me. You never know. It would be nice. I could show him the ropes and tell him, you know, slow down if he's a, another sprinter. <laughs>